it's time for another unboxing so we I recently purchased this sea life aquapod mini and uh, it's an underwater type of selfie sticks and I decided to purchase one it was on sale and I figured you know I can probably use a tool like this uh, years back I used those a very flimsy um, selfie sticks and I would mount it uh, using my GoPro but eventually those selfie sticks would kind of just uh, bent and not do its thing and uh, in the background here I have uh, three things I want to kind of do a testing and and that way um, you can kind of see the difference in what how I use my tools and so I hope this selfie stick will be enough to hold the GoPro which I read uh, on the, some comments it's, it does hold up very well but the big thing is will it hold a, a mirrorless body um, I doubt it um, I this is uh, a body that FX3 and it's got a uh, cage to it so it adds more weight to it and this lens is definitely uh, way heavy but I saw some comments that people actually use it for DSLR so let's go on and test it. Uh, go on and unbox it for me. I've got an assistant helping me out so I can film. And I can just point it according to where I need it to be. All right. Let's take out the pieces in the box. What do we have here? It looks like a head for to mount cameras. Stand by while we unbag these things. Okay, out of the box, there is instructions manual. All right, and the two pieces that came in that small bag, it looks like it is for a GoPro mount right here. And you can tighten it up as you insert it and screw that knob. So right there, uh, we're putting it all together. There is this knob here, and it gave you this uh, screw, so that way you could tighten it up. I think that's how it works. Okay, the pole itself. How does the architect uh, feel? Um, it's got some plastic pieces to it and I'm going to extract this and we get a feel for it. The head, uh, it locks in as soon as you tighten this knob right here and you can tighten up the three fourths to you know, tighten up your camera from there. But this is a plastic built. It's relatively lightweight. Um, you know, I was kind of looking for more all metal, but, uh, I'm going to go on and extract this and see how it looks. Okay, let's go and extract the first one. Okay, we're gonna lock this. We're gonna extract the next part. Okay. Okay, I have mounted the GoPro on the head, and uh, it's pretty comfortable to hold with the camera. It's very lightweight. I'm not even going to try to rig this with my mirrorless because of the weight of the mirrorless and the plastic built on this thing it's not worth um, trying to test that out because the moment I probably put it on it's going to start bending or one of these plastic pieces will snap and uh, let's go on and avoid that normally what I would do is I would have this heavy duty uh, setup right here. So I got this mini um, tripod ball head and then I, I buy these like uh, grip arms and they're pure metal and I just extend them this way. And hold on while I screw it on. Okay, as you notice, it's already starting to extend. Then I put maybe the camera or the even cell phone holder on the top of it. Check that out. I mean, it's heavy duty. It's all metal. I was hoping this would have a little bit more metal construction built to it. This is aluminum. Everything else is plastic. I was hoping like these heads would be metal. But unfortunately, you know, because it's meant for underwater and uh, they don't want it to be corrode or anything like that, excuse me, um, they wanted to stick to probably with plastic and to keep it affordable. So that's about it um i'm gonna keep it just for the sake of having a uh, selfie uh stick for my um gopro or even my phone camera so i can definitely use a little bit more high quality with that i wish there was a three-fourths on this end that you can mount so you can 
have it stand up on a tripod like that. All right, that is about it. If you guys have any question about this product, this is called Aquapod uh, Mini. Uh, I did provide a link down below in the description. If you decide to click on that link, it'll take you to Amazon. If you decide to purchase that link, it will give us a small commission. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video.